Coach Borrego, uh, Richard Walker, CarolinaSportsHub.com. Obviously, you've talked about slow starts throughout the year that happened tonight, although you battled down the stretch, kind of your summation of the game. Yeah, obviously, the first quarter cost us. Uh, I thought we were okay the rest of the way. Um, we dug our, ourselves too big of a hole there in the first quarter. We had to play perfect just to catch up. So, um, but our guys kept battling. You know, they, there's a number of teams that would have given in right there. And we just kept battling, got it to seven late. Tough call there. Um, they made some tough shots down the stretch, but that's what happens when you put yourself in that position. So, um, look, I, I'll watch the first quarter again. We were, we, I thought we were getting enough stops early in that quarter, and we just could not convert. You know, we could not find the, the bottom of the net. But, uh, you know, guys get battling, got to find, you got to give them credit. They're a heck of a defense. Obviously, they've given us trouble over the years defensively with their length and size. They give us nothing easy at the rim. Uh, they take away a lot of our pick and roll game, our, our spread game. Uh, they're a heck of a team, but we did find rhythm. I thought we found rhythm. Second half, we started to play a little faster and find some transition points. We started to hit some threes. Uh, that was important. So um, look, I saw a lot of growth throughout the game. You got to give them credit. They're a heck of a team. Hey, JB, you mentioned rhythm. Um, you know, with my start tonight, just him and LaMelo had it going against now there, just synergy-wise. Just Are you surprised by the way they've been able to kind of just become a tandem so, so quickly out there together? Yeah, Melo's done, a, you know, he's done a really nice job. I think they play off each other very nicely, um, especially Miles' ability to roll and play in transition with Melo is important for us, and they've they've hit it off. I think, you know, Melo does that with a number of guys, so um, I think Miles is one of those guys that's been the recipient of, of LaMelo's pace and his playmaking ability, and you're right. I mean, I see a connection there. Um, no matter, you know, if they're starting, they come off the bench together, whatever it is, I, I think there is synergy there between the two. Let's go to Will Kunkel and Danny Thompson. Hey, JB, obviously you can break down this film from an individual standpoint any way you want, but is it tougher to do with Terry and PJ out as a team? Yeah, I mean, look, it's, it's tough not having those two guys, so it's tough to evaluate our team as a whole. Um, but the guys that played, I'll evaluate them and see where we can get better. Obviously, there's things we could have done better tonight with or without Terry and PJ. We could have been better, especially on the offensive end. You know, I can't, we can't grow these guys any bigger. We are what we are size wise. Philly's going to have that advantage, you know, every single night against us. But I thought our guys battled overall. Uh, obviously, Terry and PJ would have helped us tonight as well. Um, but I'm proud of the group that did battle. Let's go to Danny. Coach Dane Thompson for the three-point conversion. The struggles happened, of course, like, of course, again in the first quarter. With that little film, were you, were you satisfied with the shot selection that you guys had against the Sixers in the first quarter? Yeah, I'm going to watch it. I, I didn't think it was terrible, to be honest. During the game, as it was flowing, um, you know, we looked a little bit of hesitant, probably a few of those possessions. Uh, I thought we looked a little hesitant, but... We found some rhythm against them first quarter, probably not as aggressive as I would have liked, but I still didn't, I didn't, I didn't leave that first quarter saying we weren't getting good shots. Um, you know, sometimes that ball's just got to go through the net and you feel a little bit better, but uh, obviously we couldn't find that rhythm there in the first, uh, first quarter.